for sure I was nervous. I mean, um, I get nervous when I meet normal people, so meeting the Queen is, you know, it's probably the only person in the world that everyone would love to, to meet, and I have met her. I mean, I, I kind of felt out of place when I walked into the hallway, and there's, I was standing next to a lovely young lady, a uh, young lady, she was 97 years old, and um, she... You know, she had achieved so much in her life, and she was only just receiving us. So I kind of felt that I, perhaps maybe in another 50 years. And if Royal Faber is anything to go by, he will be back. The Queen told him she'd watch the final laps of the race where he became the world champ. Fans outside were eager to meet the 24-year-old star, but it's quite clear who his number one fans are. I think to all my family, they just they've always supported me throughout my my life and throughout my career. And um, I think it's, I, I feel very proud that I'm able to, to have done something, to give something back to them for all the hard work they've done. And uh, I think they could, I can only uh, hope that they've just been proud of me today. There wasn't much time to post for pictures. Hamilton is jetting off to Barcelona for last minute testing of his car ahead of the new F1 season at the end of the month. And he reckons defending his title won't be easy. You know, there's all so many rule changes at the moment. All the cars are different. It's, it's going to be a very tough season, probably tougher than ever. And, uh, but all I can say is I've, I've prepared myself uh, to the best I could do. And uh, we're pushing very, very hard as a team. So.